The city of Fort Wayne was named after General Mad Anthony Wayne, a bold military leader who established the first American fort adjacent to the Three Rivers. The 1830s brought about the construction of the Wabash and Erie Canal in Fort Wayne. This famous canal earned Fort Wayne the nickname Summit City because it was the highest point above sea level along the entire canal route. As the 1900s rolled on in American history, Fort Wayne continued to flourish. Even during the Great Depression, Fort Wayne continued its economic Today, Fort Wayne is not only the hub of three rivers, it is also a major metropolitan area and the second largest city in Indiana. Fort Wayne continues to progress as corporations and, and individuals live, thrive, and expand together. Fort Wayne may not have any major sports teams, but it has major history. The NBA was formed here, the Comets are in their 66th hockey season, and athletes such as Rod Woodson, Dee Dee Nathan, and Demarcus Beasley grew up in the Summit City. If you look around the city and see the state-of-the-art facilities that have been built for many sports, you can see Fort Wayne embracing the future as much as the past. Teams from around the nation have come to Fort Wayne for tournaments in hockey, basketball, soccer, and other sports for years. Since Fort Wayne's establishment, the Three Rivers, the St. Mary's, the St. Joseph, and the Maumee have been an intricate part of the city from adventuring the trails along the river to getting out onto the blueways, there are plenty of opportunities for you to experience and bond with the water. In the coming years, you'll find even more ways to explore the rivers as a result of the Riverfront Fort Wayne Project, a plan to develop the rivers and make them more accessible. Fort Wayne's growing reputation as a Midwest music city is well deserved. In Fort Wayne, summer starts with the many outstanding festivals through, throughout our community. Music is a big part of what makes these events rock. Some events include Busker Fest, Make Music Day, and Balls Music Festival. After some great music and a night on the town, maybe Fort Wayne's best all-around night spot, Club Soda mixes one hell of a martini. Located in a hip, repurposed industrial building, and doubles as one of the best jazz and blues spots in town. Sizzling steaks, cool jazz, cocktails, club soda is proof that there is intelligent nightlife out there. Voted best martini bar, best place for jazz, and favorite place for a night out. Club soda brings just a little bit of Chicago to downtown Fort Wayne. Locally owned and operated, the Yummy Bunny features quality ingredients Ice cream from a family-owned Wisconsin distributor and donuts from Tom's Donuts, which have been a local tradition for over 35 years. The Yummy Bunny is the signature creation. It consists of your choice of ice cream served between the halves of a sliced donut. You also get a topping of your choice, such as various cereals or crushed Oreos. It's a mix of flavors that is definitely different than anything I'd ever eaten before, in a good way. Enjoy the legendary service, delicious food, and welcoming atmosphere in this unique restaurant concept. Specializing in an eclectic, made-from-scratch menu that offers tacos, tortadas, and other chef-driven dishes. A great selection of wine and 40 taps of craft beer is also available. Their beer program highlights mostly regional breweries, both old and up-and-coming. They also have a dynamic seating space that includes outdoor seating for the warmer months. Experience an elegant and relaxing atmosphere while you enjoy fine chocolates made with only the highest quality ingredients. Sip on gourmet hot chocolate and enjoy a decadent sundae topped with your choice of toppings or one of the many other desserts and drinks available. Whether you desire traditional creams and caramels, irresistibly rich truffles, or more exotic combinations, the brand will have the chocolate that's perfect for you. Fort Wayne has many new, up-and-coming restaurants, as well as everyone's old favorites. The history and accomplishments of the city are truly outstanding. 
It's not just the food and festivities around the city that make it great. The art and architecture from both past and present are something I truly enjoy. From the great art and history in the Fort Wayne Museum of Art, to a fun day spent at Science Central, the city definitely has a lot to offer. Fort Wayne has come a long way, even in the past few years, and continues to flourish and welcome new and exciting endeavors for all ages.